Namaste. Welcome to the fourth online gala of the Akshay Patra Foundation USA for the year 2020. Tonight's event is hosted by the Western Region from Seattle, Portland, Bay Area, Los Angeles, San Diego, Las Vegas, Phoenix, and Denver. We are going to be joined by phenomenal speakers, Mrs. Sudha Murthy, Shankar Mahadevan, Chef Sanjeev Kapoor, and Shiva Ramamurthy, our chair for the Portland City. The Akshay Patra Foundation is the world's largest midday meal program by an NGO, according to Time magazine. We serve 1.8 million children in 19,000 schools in 14 states in India every single day. As a part of a government public private partnership, it takes only $20 to feed a child for an entire year. You can look us up at www.foodforeducation.org. With millions of children under our care, we have taken the responsibility of making sure that families and children that are caught in this COVID pandemic in India are taken care of. We are supplying them with ration boxes, with cooked meals, and your support is incredibly important in their time of need. We are starting off tonight's gala with sponsorships of $2.4 million from all our host chapters. Our aim is to reach at least 3 million by the end of tonight. I hope you will support us and make sure that children in India do not go hungry to bed. Welcome, sit back, relax, let's have some fun. Hello, uh, uh, good afternoon, good evening, good morning. Uh, you know, we are all, I guess, in this new world where we are uh, constantly joining into sessions from around the world. And uh, it's, it's just wonderful to have uh, all of you, Sudhaji, um, uh, Shankar, and, and Sanjeev. Uh, I'm actually uh, calling in uh, from uh, Portland uh, in Oregon. Um, uh, I know Sanjeev is... Uh, 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 traveling all the time on the road, so I couldn't tell where he is. Shankar, I assume uh, you are from uh, calling in from Mumbai, and uh, we have Sudhaji calling from Bangalore, I assume. And uh, uh, welcome, welcome to this uh, session. Uh, Thank we, you. We hope to have a, a great conversation with you. Uh, to uh, start out with, I, I, I'm always fascinated by one thing about Akshay Patra, and I, I, I'll just touch upon that from the beginning. Uh, you know, we've all involved in lots of different uh, organizations, lots of activities in our lives. We have uh, a diverse set of interests, all of us. Um, but one thing I find fascinating about Akshay Padra and the and the and the and the, uh, the, the, the the mission that Akshay Padra has is the diversity of people that it brings. It, it is it is always just amazing to me uh, the people that I run into. Um, uh, you know. Uh, people who are known, people who are not known, people who are very young, people who are very old, people in the middle. It, it, it just completely fascinates me. I, I just want to sort of kick the conversation off, just getting your thought on what, what draws us to this. And I, I, any, anyone can sort of kick us into that conversation. Well, I'm being the oldest. Let me start with me. Um, my work is uh, in the philanthropy and with the poor people and uh, needy people. So Akshay Patra stands for that. And, uh, uh, you know, in my work or traveling all over Karnataka and India, uh, particularly in the uh, poverty area where economically weaker section, I saw the most important is first is food, then education. Though education is very, very important, but your stomach is empty, then children don't come to school. Then how will you, how will they concentrate? So I realized that food is so important to those children. And that is the very reason that Akshay Patra attracted me because they do the bottom most of the pyramid is that, that is the food and uh, that they take care in the school. So that attracted me. Yes. Fantastic. Uh, Sajid. So uh, for me, uh, so I, I've been around food uh, since uh, childhood and when I got into profession of uh, food and uh, cooking. So it was uh, all about excess of food in some sense because that's what uh, we've been uh, taught. Uh, that, that's what uh, 
um, we we uh, we would convert things in a way where uh, we wouldn't worry about uh, the quantity in that sense, but we would just work on finesse, work on uh, uh, making it look good, make it taste good and uh, fabulous, all the finesse that it can uh, bring. So all my achievements revolved around that and uh, people knew me uh, for that. But uh, uh, when I um, uh, got to know about uh, Akshapatra and uh, I realized there was a part of me uh, which uh, knew nothing about the kind of uh, work in food that is needed and w- was being done. And though uh, people thought that I had achieved a lot, people thought that uh, I knew a lot, but there was so much that I didn't know. There was so much that I had to learn. And that's where I would say that uh, Akshapatra came uh, uh, to me as my teacher to teach me in uh, my world of food. And there's so much that I, I have learned from Akshapatra that I, that I continue to learn. So I, I owe a big amount of my learning in food uh, to Akshapatra. And I, that, that's why uh, people think that I am helping uh, Akshapatra, but actually it's quite the opposite. Uh, I, I get so much from Akshapatra. That is, that is so true, isn't it? I mean, we get into things thinking that we're going to contribute and uh, you, you actually be, be, become the gainer uh, in, in yeah. so many things in life. Uh, Shankar, would love to hear your thoughts on... on uh, well, uh, uh, firstly, before I go ahead, you know, Sanjeev is a brother. We have, we have you know, uh, interacted so many times and, you know, on so many various times. But never in my life I thought that I'm going to be sitting on a platform where uh, Mrs. Sudha Murthy is also going to be there and I'm also going to be talking. This is truly a blessed day for me, Sudhaji. I can't even tell you what an inspiration you are for all of us, of course. Yes. So I'm really feeling blessed now. And so, this is, I'm speaking from my heart. I'm not just simply saying your simplicity, your humility. I need not mention all these things, but it is just unbelievable that I'm sitting here with you in this. Uh, and uh, as, as both of them said, you know, uh, many years back, I was, uh, you know, as musicians, we keep traveling to various, uh, you know, uh, uh, causes, whether it is cancer, whether it's AIDS awareness, whether it is something else. And similarly, I had, I had uh, performed for Akshay Patra many, many, many years back with a brother of mine, Mandolin Srinivas. Both of us, mm-hmm. him and me, we had performed for Akshay Patra for a, for a wonderful uh, evening where, you know, uh, they did a fundraiser and they wanted to. And that's when, when they played that AV, that's when I realized what these people are doing, you know. And then... In a few months, you know, I was very inquisitive. Then I met some common friends who were there, you know, Sridhar, who's heading, uh, you know, Akshay Patra. I met him and a few other people. And then I came to know the magnitude of what these people are doing. Then they asked me whether I could, you know, in a way, compose a song for Akshay Patra. And, uh, you know, uh, music is an amazing communicator, you know, something that you want to speak for five pages. If you put it down in a in a three-minute three, li- three song, you can communicate that very easily and it reaches out. So we created a beautiful song for Akshay Patra. And that is yeah. when, when we launched the song, that is when I went and visited the facility. I went there and I saw how the food is being made and how actually the food is being made. And that really, really blew me apart and said that, I mean, this is amazing. So I really, really, you know, felt that this is a genuine, genuine organization. And I really felt privileged to be part of this. And then Shankar, I was trying to avoid gushing like a teenager in uh, Sudhaji's presence, but I share the same <laughs> it, it is a, It's a blessing uh, to be here today. Um, so I'm going to have a problem, Shankar, if I, um, my, my text messages are going to go off and emails are going to start showing up. Uh, if I didn't ask you to uh, sing for us soon enough. So yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm going to have you just start this off with a with a with a with a little uh, invocation of some sort, and I'll leave it to you. Of course, why not? Like yeah, yeah. I think it's for a Javed actor, no? It's a Javed actor. Yes, that would be lovely if you could do yeah. Gandhi, Roshni, or any anything else that you'd like. Beautiful, beautiful. Whichever. Yeah. You this song. This since we are talking about Akshay Patra, I'll just sing two lines of the song that that I had done for Akshay Patra. Um, <laughs> हमें लिखना है पढ़ना है आगे ही बढ़ना है खाते ही हम ये कसम 
जो ज्ञान करसता है शिक्षा करसता है उसी पे चलेंगे हम सो दिस वाज अ सॉन्ग दैट वी हैड मेड फॉर द चिल्ड्रन वाज सिंगिंग विद मी एंड वी शॉट अ वीडियो एंड ऑल दैट या या एंड आई 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 थिंक यू डिड दिस इन 2012 और 2013 इफ आई रिमेंबर राइट लॉन्ग टाइम अगो and i Very i listened to it uh, listened to it last week and it's amazing uh, when it when it comes out right uh, the freshness of it right uh, thank you thank you it, thank it, you shiva it, it's it's retained forever it's uh, it's actually uh, uh, wonderful to see that um i i think uh, the um uh, the generally our 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 contributors are obviously around the world our supporters are around the world um i i think uh, everyone's kind of eager to hear your own relationship with akshay padra and i think i think uh, uh, what what kind of continues that relationship you know sudaji has been uh, with akshay padra from virtually the beginning for for you know 20 years uh, sanjeev i i would be remiss if i i think it's over 10 years for you i don't know how long and shankar similarly so it'll be sort of what is that longevity what is our connection Uh, Suda ji, you, 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 please speak. <laughs> When you speak, we just listen. Yeah. <laughs> no, no. Being a woman, I talk more. Being a mother, I talk more. <laughs> And being a writer, I talk more. So I think I should talk less now. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. We are all here. We are all here to listen to you. <laughs> For me, singing is much easier. You know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, uh, you know, there are many incident in my. work i have seen uh, children not coming to school uh, and you know uh, once you know we were distributing uh, before akshay patra we also used to give some food not cooked food like a bun apple banana something there biscuit packet so this work we were doing six 25 years back it was six 25 years so 25 years back once i was distributing some fruit and uh, biscuit bundle in some village i want to remember near a bangalore and she, the child told me i said you eat here the child said no i have another sister at home and for her i am taking i felt very sad you know that a child who was almost maybe 7 years old um that child even a two biscuit and one apple means a lot to share so i asked what about your sister is that she goes for a kuli or something she must be around 9 or 10 years old i said why she doesn't come to school and that boy told me no she can't because we have to earn my share to earn money and so that you can uh, all of us can eat i said suppose she can eat in the school then what happens is that then she will definitely come he said aji aji in kannada means uh, grandma mm-hmm. he said aji uh, if uh, my sister also comes then she if she gets food she will also come and that was i felt so much when i came home uh, just thinking about it a handful of rice two roti a bowl of uh, sabji or i i even say a dal can bring a 10 years kid to school may not even for studies at least for the food then we must do i i always felt india is well known in many fields outside the country shiva may be knowing like we people talk about uh, Uh, software we will talk about bollywood uh, many many things but for me my country is prosperous when a child can eat two meals and one breakfast have three sets of clothes and study up to 12th class and have learn a skill to survive i call my country is prosperous and i think my country my country men are very happy and that kicked me saying that a handful of rice can bring a child to school and how to do that alone i will not be able to do with foundation we will not be able to do because we have many many projects yes at that time started uh, uh, madhu pandit das and chanchal pati they came and told me we are thinking of akshay patra and it's a beautiful name because of krishna's name is krishna gave the akshay patra to draupadi etc and i was one of the first contributor in those days i think we gave 25 lakhs or something and it continues to be because hunger is not at eradicated from our country not at all so it yes. continues so it continue we continue with them and the strong relationship i have with them more than 22 23 whatever the day one it started still i feel we have built two three kitchens of excellent type of kitchen spent about 50 60 crore rupees only on kitchens everything we have done then once i was in jaipur and that time children said uh, we are they are falling sick because the food was good but the water was bad hmm. then we started jaladhara scheme in uh, 
uh, with Akshay Patra, water also in certain area. So that we also are working with them in so many other pro projects, but connected with the school children and their food, water, and connected with that. That that's wonderful, uh, Shankar. Uh, your connection, please. You know, that's what I'm. Uh, so once I saw, as I was telling you earlier, once I saw this uh, amazing facility that uh, you know uh, Akshay Patra had, and the way. See, the thing is, uh, one thing is the intention to do it, and one thing is actually executing it. You know, without the food being touched and uh, it reaches out to the to the end user, it is just amazing. And the and the smile that I saw in the children's faces, and uh, you know, I really felt that I should get myself associated with this uh, organization. So whenever there has been a case where, you know, they want me to be present for any kind of function or any kind of contribution or any kind of, you know, uh, many states. See, this was very South-centric in the beginning. Till Sudhaji came and they set it up in Jaipur and Delhi and all that. You know, uh, talking to various, you know, uh, political uh, the chief ministers of a particular state, when they wanted, you know, my presence there, I saw to it that I'm there with them uh, to, you know, kind of also to propagate the idea of Akshay Patra and see to it that, uh, you know, it reaches out far and wide uh, in the country. So, uh, and, and me being a person who sings, uh, somehow, you know, when, when we, we talk something, when we sing something, people listen with little more attention, right. you know. Yes. So that's why I said, whenever you use me, you use me, use my voice, use my song, whatever you want, just use me to propagate this idea and let the message reach out to everybody. Yeah. And Sanjeev, for those of us who live in the U.S., uh, we are so aware of your generosity of time. And uh, there's probably not a chapter in the U.S. that hasn't seen you personally. Uh, you know, I, I just would like to hear your connection. Of course, it's, there's an obvious connection with food and so on and so forth. But there is something deeper than that. No, I, I think, uh, as uh, Sudhaji mentioned, I think uh, there are uh, uh, millions and millions of uh, uh, stories uh, that bind us, uh, which connect us uh, with food and uh, food, such a basic need. And it, it's not something uh, which not all stories are told. Not everything uh, is something that we get to hear. Some, uh, I, I can share uh, that uh, as a child, I didn't know that I would become a chef uh, like uh, Shankar who uh, went into engineering. I, I probably uh, also, uh, I was also almost uh, there. But uh, I think uh, that deep uh, down, so my, my um, father, uh, uh, during partition, he lost uh, both his uh, parents, right? And he uh, literally brought himself up as an orphan. So I know his uh, struggle, which he never shared any uh, struggle with the, us, but we knew that, uh, and th there was uh, nothing that we were denied in terms of uh, uh, food was always good, uh, but uh, there was nothing, nothing in plenty, but we, we had everything uh, enough. So I always felt that uh, we, we should not waste anything because uh, our parents had had uh, so, uh, such a tough life. So we should not waste uh, anything. So when I uh, got an opportunity uh, to uh, choose that, okay, what profession? One of the things was uh, fertile management. Mm -hmm. And one of the key decisions, which uh, today I can tell you that... Uh, played on my mind was, and I probably took, uh, uh, I, I did not go into architecture, I went into hotel management was, because at hotel management, fees included a lunch in the college because we had to cook. And that was something that I was saving that money is something that fees was low, one, and that also included. So I'm, I'm saying that it is not that you have to be really poor to connect with food. And uh, this, is, this is reality uh, for us. So when deep down, I understand, uh, I understand what it uh, means, what importance of uh, food uh, at a workplace, at uh, a school, at a college, what it uh, means. So somebody who is doing it at such a scale, and uh, with such a motivated team and people like yourselves, you, I've, I've, uh, I've been uh, to Portland, I've, we've met and we, I know how much time you gave and uh, your family. It's not just you, it's the, the, uh, what uh, Vandana is uh, doing, what Sridhar and team are uh, doing. I, I think uh, uh, we, we feel, uh, I, I think all of us who are doing maybe once in a while, maybe uh, 20, 30 days uh, in a year, 
it is nothing compared to uh, what many more people are doing so i would say that uh, people like me we started late uh, uh, suraji uh, started uh, uh, contributing uh, from the very beginning at akshay patra 25 years ago we we joined uh, later so i would say that uh, our story has just uh, begun we have to catch up we have to so uh, when you say that when uh, vanna tells me that okay we have this 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 as okay i don't ask so uh, this is okay this is what we have to do i said okay this is what we have to do so it it it's uh, uh, we we have a lot of uh, catching up to do um, I, i feel that uh, there's much more that we have uh, to do so it's it's uh, uh, it's just the beginning for us for me as, i can say yeah. as we are getting you know more chapters in the us it seems like there's almost an assumption when is sanjeev coming to our city you know and then you know i, I guess uh, we we should in some ways learn that from sudha ji uh, you know as, as a full time social worker you're also a, a full time teacher and a full time author and a full time movie buff uh, you know <laughs> how many hours do you have in the day is, is the real question uh, no i used to teach nowadays i don't teach because i really don't get time and even in this pandemic you know i'm extremely busy because we are we are, you know we are take, we are taken a hospital and we are running it and you know it, it takes full 10 hours 12 hours a day on telephone uh, so i i, I don't teach now uh movies uh, of late i have not seen that many but still uh, my uh, i see a lot of movies that is maybe at 9 o'clock in the night i start seeing at least one movie a day <laughs> okay, one more and i see in marathi i see in uh, telugu i see in kannada of course my mother tongue then i see in uh, tamil with the subtitle malayalam with the subtitle hindi to i enjoy okay uh, then i write in the morning early morning i write but i don't my do either work I don't do any other work because I know I don't uh, entertain people much. Actually, I hardly. I don't go to anybody's house. I don't attend any weddings because I I rather convert that into my either work hours or my hobby. Many people do not know. I'm extremely fond of history. Since 50 years, I read history. Wow! So in, in, uh, every day I read about an hour, hour and a half history. Every day I do that in comedy also. <laughs> so I enjoy white roses. the war war of roses it is beautifully done of course apart from crown uh, hindi um, hindi which one i i enjoyed more uh, i saw all devan's movie this time black and white wow uh, <laughs> devan and, nice. and sadna's sadna's debut movie love in simla yeah <laughs> love in simla i saw and she, i felt she resembled uh, audrey even uh, in a roman holiday similar kind of face <laughs> and her yes, yes 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 yeah you're right you're right there yeah. are, there are uh, parak there are fantastic i don't know who is the music director what a music and what a songs are there oh the sajna barakha bahar aaya kyon mein oh i think it's yeah. madan mohan madan mohan madan mohan i think madan mohan is it and uh, there are two movies one more more song is that so beautiful with that hibiscus flower she sings it is just out of the world beautiful and i like madan mohan also because after he died after 25 years veer dharai ah. made look at the ah, music yes. creation yeah yes 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 yeah. you yes, know madan all mohan. the songs from veer zara suda ji they are yeah. rejected songs by madan mohan yes i know i know but they are fantastic Huh. There's a song. Salil Chaudhary, I think. Salil Chaudhary is uh, Parak. Salil Ch- Parak, no? Parak is Salil Chaudhary. Yes. Salil Very Chaudhary. Very beautiful. Yes. Very beautiful. So there is no end. Oh. Shiva, if I have to talk about movie, me and me <laughs> and Shiva, I think another two hours will take. But those <laughs> yeah. are fantastic yeah. movies. I felt it in terms We of. We have all the time to listen to you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's amazing. That oh, amazing. Oh, Sajna, Barkha Bahar, I what a composition. Oh. Yeah. Then It's normally amazing. I like to, I like to, I like to rock. I really want to sing that right now. <laughs> yeah, why can't you sing Shankar? <laughs> Shankar, please. I, you know what? I, what I like about that uh, Oh Sajna is that that second antra, you know. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, hmm. 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 Hmm.
My God. Amazing composition. Yeah. So amazing. Wow. You know, Siva, any, any movie you ask Sudha Ji, she has seen. She is unbelievable. And every song that, you know, I have composed, she knows the song. She says, yeah, I've heard this. I've, I was shocked the first time when I met her. And, uh, I went to you in know, a hotel I, with her. Prasoon Jushi yeah. was with you. And I told you, Senorita, I told you to sing. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, oh, I remember God. that song. Okay. So, so, so that you maybe we should have you request uh, the next song then. Uh, <laughs> pretty warmed up now. Actually, actually, Shankar, I would have told you to sing this uh, Katarga, Kazad Gusli, that movie. Why not? You have Why? acted, you have acted very well in that, and the song is also Chanda Ganapati, and that Chanda one is really. I'll beautiful. sing for you. I'll sing for you yeah, now. Yeah. I'll sing for you. Yeah. See, these are opportunities that I never get, Sudaji. When you ask me to <laughs> sing, it's it's a blessing for me, really. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, The song is called Sur Niragas Ho, which means let the let your song be innocent. Mm. Let the song be pure. Let the song yes. be innocent. Which I which we felt is a very nice line. That's how we composed the song. So. Ganapati Subhanayana Karuna Maya Gauri Harasi Varada Vinayaka Oomkar Ganapati Oomkar Ganapati Adhipati Sukhapati Chandapati Chandapati Nenani Rakaraho Sura Nira Gasaho Sura Nira Gasaho Ganapati Sura Nira Gasaho Wow, thank you. That's, that's beautiful. Amazing, amazing. Yeah. So, 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 you pointed out that Shankar has acted in a few movies. Mm-hmm. Uh, we also know that you did too. <laughs> how, how many how many movies did you act in? Really? Yeah, but you know, I told those people who were after me. Then I told them, look, I have some condition. You can't make me to have a, you know, a very decorative role, like, you know, wearing a lot of jewelries and um, color my hair and such things. It doesn't suit me. How do I look in the same way I, I, I would like to act? So the best way is no acting is Judge's role, where there are no expression. <laughs> oh, no, no, but I found out very difficult to act. Extremely difficult to act. And yes. then I don't want dialogue, I told them. I don't want too many dialogues. I don't want anything. Then what else they can give me? Judge, you <laughs> want to order, order, such thing, that kind. But I told them, I cannot, I will enjoy movies. But I just cannot act. It's so hard. You know, it's the hamara bas ka baat nahi hai. <laughs> like you know, good food. I can't cook excellent food like Sanjeev. But you know, I enjoy. I can't sing like Shankar. I can enjoy. I cannot act, but I enjoy movies. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> that's, but, that's amazing. So, but, so you know, you, you're all uh, you know prolifically creative. Uh, you uh-huh. know, Shankar writes amazing songs. Uh, Sanjeev creates. Uh, you know, wonderful food and recipes and books and uh, on and on and on. And so the, you're a prolific author. You've written, I, 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 I've heard of over 30 books. And I heard you say somewhere that you have three or four books actually stashed away and you don't want to release more than one a year. 
धैर्य क्यों ना कतार में है कतार में है कतार कंट्री यू नो मैं हिंदी वो इधर कतार कंट्री क्यों में है कोविड टाइम आई रोट वन बुक यू नो दैट इज गोइंग टू कम नाउ बट यू नो आई डोंट लाइक टू रिलीज मोर देन अ बुक यार एंड आई आई कंप्लीटली एग्री दैट क्रिएटिविटी फॉर मी एट लीस्ट आई नो it i really don't know how to define it i think it is mata saraswati's uh, kripa i'll be able to write i re- otherwise if you if uh, you tell me to write for a particular reason in 10 days you have to give 10000 words i can't do that it's only she when she smiles she blesses my pen or my computer writes that's all i'm only the so writer the original creator is saraswati <laughs> absolutely absolutely that is so true that is so true uh-huh. more philosophical hopeful note i i have a op- open ended question um you know i i spent all my adult life uh, working for a single company but i was very lucky that i spent 50% of those 30 years in india uh, i spent time in bangalore in the 90s then i lived in delhi through most of the uh, the late uh, 20 uh, to 2000s um and uh, and i have uh, this mixed life of having lived in the us as well as lived in india for a long time obviously i grew up in india um as we emerge out of this you know as as th- things um redefine themselves and and i i think we we are all guessing what that might be how do we create a new social contract do you think a new social contract will emerge in india where uh, we don't go back to business as usual what signals are you seeing in in the broader ecosystem in india it's uh, too early to say uh because for any change to happen it's it's uh, uh, it's a very slow process uh, and uh, so th- there are things uh, which uh, uh, before this also before uh, pandemic uh, also there are many things so l- let's let's look at uh, uh, problem uh, like hunger right uh, there have been attempts and uh, it's uh, getting uh, corrected it's getting better uh, it's but still we are still uh, not there something uh, like clean india or swachh uh, bharat and uh, it it's something these are behavioral changes mm-hmm. uh, which which happen and uh, for us to say that uh, uh, something like this uh, will change our thing so i uh, i know that uh, i i was uh, talking uh, to a group of uh, my uh, parents uh, age uh, a couple of years ago and i was saying that uh, when i travel to countries like us the uh, philanthropy uh, what i see the way people give there i don't see that uh, here in india to the extent because i have been in room full in you know, five star hotels with big names and all uh, uh, people like uh, uh, sudaji and uh, they are far and few between that they are not uh, to, uh, generous people uh, of uh, uh, that uh, level in india why does uh, that happen and one thing that uh, came out very clearly was that uh, it is lot to do uh, they said uh, you know what uh, there was a struggle uh, after independence uh, there was a whole uh, range of uh, people who were busy first filling their stomachs so uh, and then they could start thinking that they have to give something i said no but this is something uh, poor people can also share it's not something he says no it's not something that when you are struggling to uh, keep uh, make two ends meet that comes does not come intuitively uh, it should it come so it's a behavioral thing so what kind of behavior we would uh, see one good thing i can say is that uh, with all this problem so uh, poor people there's some money that has uh, gone into them but people in city people daily labor uh, people in uh, whether music industry whether in retail whether uh, daily wage earner in uh, uh, whether in hotel restaurant wherever all these industry they they have actually got no source of income in all these months they have not revolted they have stayed calm they have and i think that says a lot about indians their their way of thinking the way they uh, they they take things in their stride and i i say that you know what india has been in state of pandemic always we never had the luxury of going to hospitals we we didn't have a hospital the uh, healthcare or even in cities people who could afford they would not find a uh, hospital bed easily you would have to make calls and things like that so what has uh, changed i think uh, 
the behavioral change will take some time and I hope that it's for good. And that's my hope. And when I speak to people, there is more compassion that is coming through. We, we are seeing it. But would it to convert into practice? We will have to see. So I, we are not to hear your thoughts. Yeah, I agree with the Sanjeev. The, uh, I always tell this to Narayan Murthy that um, anything happens on computer, any new version comes in America, within a day you get it. But human change, human behavior change takes time. Any social change takes time. Maybe months, maybe years. It is not that India, uh, this is the toughest time in India. It is really not true because look at India's uh, history for the last 100 years. 1918, we had a Spanish flu and the maximum people who died uh, in the world where they were Indians. Then you had partition. How many people died you have seen in partition? Yeah. There was a worst Bengal uh, uh, drought and how many people perished? Uh, maybe 40, 50 lakhs people died, much more than uh, coronavirus today. Uh, and there are floods. This year we had double edge actually. Once we are working for uh, uh, Corona, other way, I'm working in Bengal and Assam uh, and okay. Orissa for the floods. Yeah. So every year we have one. I'm counting last 15 years, not even a single year has gone. Look here, there is nothing. There are always natural calamities. There are always problems. But Basically, our culture, like what Sanjeev says, is, is a, a, a quiet or a, a faith or a positive thinking culture. That's when there are no rewards. If it were like in any other Western country, particularly like you have seen uh, French Revolution, the root cause of French Revolution is uh, people are unhappy. Yes. So yes. our way of thinking is different. And again, I have noticed one more thing. Since 20 years or 22 years after liberalization, there is a lot more giving. Mm. Oh no, yeah, originally only Tata's were giving. You know, originally mm. Tata's were giving. Now it is a person like us are also giving. Okay. Apart from that, you know, in our foundation, when you do good work, people come and would like to come in. Yes. When I'm doing uh, work every time, you know, people write to me. Today only one a man who was 89 years old called me and said, I have one lakh rupees from my pension I have saved. I want to give it to you for COVID. Mm. I stretched. I said, No, no, don't worry. I told him some other agency you should give where they really require. And I've seen our own employee that enforces. Uh, you know, uh, whenever there is any emergency, they come physically and help. Yeah. They also give their salary. And particularly, I've seen a common man coming and giving us, okay, 10 kg of rice I can give. 50 kg of dal somebody gives. So I look in a positive angle yeah. and I feel people are giving. And uh, again, you know, I learned this one. I used to think poor people cannot give, but it was not true. Uh, one day, I, I have a dog by the name Gopi. And Gopi loves paneer. One day, I gave him paneer and there's a street dog. He, you know, he was passing by. I gave him a chapati. Gopi, after all, a year and a half kid, you know, I mean, a pup for me, he's a kid. He looked at me and he looked at the little street dog. He took half the paneer and went and threw there. I hmm. just hugged my gopi. I said, you taught me a lesson. You are not speaking, Amazing. but you taught me a lesson. Anybody can share whatever they have. Yeah. Then when God has given us so much, and you know, you just think, you are sitting at home, all of us are sitting at home six, four months. Just think and internalize how much money we require. Yes. How much Correct. you can give it to our children. You know, the more you keep for your children, they get into a lot more bad habits mm -hmm. and a lot more they want to work. Keep money for the children. I never say don't keep. But somewhere you have to draw a line. Right. Look, beta A is yours, B is mine, C is for philanthropy. Yes. And A, B, C compartment, you make it. Not yes. I will make it. I can't make it for Shankar or Sanjeev. Yes. Sanjeev should make for himself. Shankar should make for yourself. Shiva should make for yourself. And all your um, guests who are listening, you make the compartments how much you want to give. Shakti. That's what our elders have told. Yatha Shakti. I, I'm an ant. What is my Shakti? I can do that much. I'm an elephant. What is my power? I will do. So please do not look down upon somebody giving 10 rupees, somebody giving 1 rupee, somebody giving 1,000 rupees, somebody giving crores of rupees. According to me, A by B is equal to 2 by 4 is equal to 3 by 6 is equal to 4 by 8. <laughs> it's That's all beautiful. the same. That's beautiful. All the same. And I learned it from my dog Gopi sharing his loving paneer to a street dog and he puts it in front of That's amazing. Dog. 
That's beautiful. So Amazing. You can all you can always learn anytime, and you can share. If you share, I think even in pandemic, you know, you share till you can manage. Because I work with daily construction workers, um, these housemates and all. You know, if you everybody shares a little bit, still you can manage it. And That's please beautiful. share. And next generation is sharing. Yeah. Next generation is much more philanthropic. Uh, I, yeah. activity I, I totally us. agree. Totally agree. Okay. Definitely. Yeah. And Shankar, see, now uh, you see why yeah. I said that I feel blessed sitting in this yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, today's talk because, because you are this right. is what is inspiration. This yes. is inspiration. You know, ma'am, uh, Sudhaji, because you have employees who are ready to share because they have a leader like you in the company. I have seen videos of you sitting on the floor with plastic packets and, you know, filling uh, uh, food and you know, segregating. You yourself ration. I remember during yeah. the floods, I, there was a video yeah, that yeah. didn't come. So they have a leader like you. Obviously, they are going to follow you. Uh, really, what a what an amazing person you are. Really, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Totally share that sentiment, Shankar. So, Shankar, it's uh, your job now to draw Sanjeev into a song. I do. You know, so please. Upon this philanthropy, the line that you have chosen, the the path that you have taken. So, I really hope that you know, uh, in the introduction speech of Akshay Patra, one person said, "I think uh, uh, I don't remember who spoke that day." They said that our aim is to see to it that in another twenty years, an organization like Akshay Patra doesn't cease to exist, yeah. so that yeah. we don't have to. So let us hope that you know everybody in the in the world gets fed, and जो लक्ष है उसको पाके रहेंगे. हाँ यही रास्ता है तेरा तूने अब जाना है हाँ यही सपना है तेरा तूने पहचाना है तुझे अब ये दिखाना है रोके तुझको आंधिया या जमीन और आसमां पाएगा जो लक्ष्य है तेरा लक्ष्य को हर हाल में पाना है लक्ष्य को हर हाल में पाना है कुछ मूवी तुझे फ्रॉम कुछ मूवी This is from Laksh. Uh, I know Ruthie Karoshan and Preeti Zinta. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, she is go. unbelievable. Shubhaji, <laughs> 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 do amazing. you sing? Can you sing something for us? Yes. Not at all. No, singing is not my domain. Absolutely okay. not. <laughs> <laughs> Donkeys are better than me. <laughs> <laughs> I want to tell all the viewers a small, one small message. A generosity of few is hope for million. Oh yes. wow, that's beautiful. Yeah. It is not my. It is not my quote. I saw this quote in Los Angeles hospital. You know, it really touched my heart. Whatever you have, please be generous. Generosity of few is hope for million. You are lighting the lamps of million hearts. Please be generous. Okay, that's the reason God has made you rich. There's a reason why God has made you rich, because you can create million lamps. Wow! Wow! Okay. Yeah. yeah. I um, I would like uh, an opportunity to have the three of you uh, ask uh, e- each other questions for a few minutes. So uh, we take this advantage of having uh, the three of you on on the panel and uh, uh, and. Uh, Uh, maybe we, after that we can uh, wrap up and go to uh, live questions because a lot of people are waiting <laughs> to to ask you questions. I think Shankar, I, 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 I ask you. Okay, okay, you ask. Yeah, yeah. No, I already asked you, you many questions. Yeah. You ask me yes, now. Yes. I'll ask yeah. you. I want to know because you know, being somebody whom we really, really look up to, I want to know what is a typical day like. <laughs> well. Uh, Uh, yeah, if I'm writing in that time, that days are different. If I'm not writing, maybe six o'clock I get up. Then I, I will exercise. I will walk or I will do something physical activity. Then seven seven thirty I'll be in my office. Okay, oh. and I'll be. I don't even come home for lunch. Rarely I come because I really don't have time. We get around four hundred emails, two hundred calls a day. 
and absolutely no time and come back around 5 5:30 then i relax for half an hour read something then i will have a very early dinner in indian standard time around 7 o'clock then i will do two hours of whatever it will work Uh, related to my work or related to my um, how, you know reading or writing anything is left there i will do that 9 o'clock i will see a movie 9 to 10 30 then <laughs> every day i will see actually yesterday baat ek raat ki i see black and white movies also baat ek raat ki devan oh. and vaida uh, rehman okay 1960 precisely 1960 okay so uh that is the uh, working day and uh, otherwise i used to travel 22 days in a month now i am really pinned down but i work 10 days on the phone it's very hard to work from home i really don't like it i prefer yeah. to be in the office but you know i have to do that because of various reasons so we are very busy with the covid hospitals and patient you know we arrange the ambulance take the patient you know call them put them into the hospital then uh, progress then getting them tested very busy with that So I never felt up to this day I'm getting bored, but I don't know when I'll feel. <laughs> I don't know that. Wonderful. But rarely, God, rarely I attend function. Rarely. Yes. Uh-huh. Well, amazing. Such an amazing. Amazing. So if if I were to uh, invite uh, uh, three of you uh, to my house, uh-huh. right? When when would you find time? Well, I will do when I'm in Bombay. I'll club with all the meetings, and uh, I'll definitely come. because i have great regards for tatas you know all of them know i suppose and i really respect you because you have brought a change in indian cooking you know golden days more the ghee more the oil more the sugar then it's oh somebody comes okay oh, you know lot of fried stuff there is to do but by reading you was and you connect to the next generation my daughter does you uh, this your book my granddaughter who is 9 years old she loves cooking very wow. much she loves cooking and she says aji give me your book so you know sanju kapoor's book i said microwave wow. cooking or something that kind you know you connect to krishna my granddaughter's uh, age my daughter's age and my age it is something unimaginable that's beautiful so, so oh. when you call me i will definitely come and i will tell him make something with like, i don't have to tell him. make him a good tasty diet food i will tell him. that's yeah yeah that that and, home food i'll give you uh, what the way home we food. eat it and uh, yeah. we'll get yeah. uh, shankar uh, shankar to yeah. sing and leave uh, no 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 to begin with i'll be your dal. assistant <laughs> <laughs> no you are master now <laughs> i'll be your really assistant <laughs> <laughs> so sanjeev not yeah, yeah. dal makhani Uh, not that much can get only and i will tell shankar to sing a song okay that yes. will yes. oh, so yeah, maybe yeah, shankar yeah. will uh, will make that into the transition maybe you <laughs> sing for us and we go into q and a what is this you are going to sing you tell me what you are going to sing you you tell me what you want me to sing shall i sing kalona yeah, ho shall i sing or kalona ho is nice kalona sonu nigam sir sonu nigam and priti zinta <laughs> saif ali khan sharukh khan jay badure look at this <laughs> amazing chaliye <laughs> chaliye kalona ho ghadi badal rahi hai roop zindagi chao hai kabhi कभी कभी है तो तो है तो तो जिंदगी अरे जो है समान कल हो बदल रही है रूप जिंदगी छाव है कभी कभी है धूप जिंदगी हर पल जहां जो है समान मतलब इसको कहते हैं देखो लॉटरी अक्षय पात्रा से कैसे जुड़े वाई डू यू बी विद अक्षय पात्रा यू गेट अ चांस टू सिंग विद 
दी शंकर somebody who will come to your house sudha ji uh-huh. and uh-huh. her daughter and her granddaughter they uh-huh. like my recipe and shiva is moderating a session like this and we have vandana listening into what we are saying isko aur kya chahiye matlab thank you akshay patra thank you so blessing. much what can i say blessing blessing ट्रांसिशन So, um, uh, first to you, Sudha Ji, as as a former uh, teacher, I, I I shouldn't call you former teacher. You're always teaching, um, and and uh, as you as you mentioned, you are a history buff. You you read so much. Um, there is a tremendous battle going on in India uh, on the future of education, on the future of um, curriculum and history, and what children should be taught. Uh, some of it is uh, tragically not going in in a great direction. Uh, but before i color it with my own uh, opinion uh, i would uh, i'd like to paraphrase the question i got on where do you think uh, india should or how should india treat education going forward um, that's that's a question that's been asked to me yes uh, our education system has to change because it is there with us for maybe more than 100 years i suppose just what teacher says listen to that don't ask questions and just copy and memorize and pass the examination which is not acceptable today because children have to think they have to ask questions they have to think out of the box education does not mean only scoring marks and getting the medals though i got medals i tell you that education means much more much more holistic much more thinking about the basic questions and i feel it's important that Our, our method of teaching should change. Our syllabus has to change, and our our way of teaching has to change. Instead of memorizing, think and answer. Seeker of knowledge is more important than product and than remember. Depending, uh, uh, you know, uh, on your memory power, what you produce, and that is exactly what Indians want now because their children have to think, and thinkers always change. that's what i believe in it and i also believe we should introduce the classical indian literature in the school like you know how many of us unless we try at home know about kalidasa no okay we do not know because it is never introduced in school some people will go out of the way and study how many of them know the great sanskrit literature at this time the statistic says the amount of sanskrit literature alone is probably the double of that's what i got it from a murti classical library double of the latin and greek literature put together apart from classical languages like tamil or kannada you know sanskrit apart from sanskrit there are many classical languages there in india so it has to be introduced because you should feel proud about your roots about your country about your literature then only you appreciate that it is nice to learn other languages and other lit- treasure you should also know your mother you know your mother is very important so you must know india's classical literature it should be part of the curriculum i feel oh, beautifully said so shankar for you it's uh, more of a creative process question um there is a lot of structure in music and we all know how mathematical indian uh, classical music is Uh, but the question has to do with that creative process where uh, a certain spark hits you and takes you down a certain path that you perhaps didn't even anticipate a second before uh, so talk to us and people would love to hear how how that has impacted your own music uh, you know uh, any creative process is a trigger shiva anything it starts off with a trigger it can be one note it can be just a beat it can be a set of lyrics it can be something that inspires you. you you know what inspires you and what is the final product probably they two they both are not connected at all but inspiration comes from 
you know somewhere else it's like it's like water leakage you know it enters from somewhere but it comes out from some other place so i think it's nice to get inspired from various genres of uh, uh, genres of music and you know and a melody a melody is basically a journey of a note you know you you, you can imagine a one led bulb you know one led bulb which is moving in in a big led panel just one light is up and that led bulb is moving and it has to move from one point a to point b okay now it has got a million routes which it can take you know i want to go from bombay to pune i can go uh, to lonavala and go there i can go to darwad and i can go there i can go to belgaum i can go there i can go back to chennai and fly back to pune i've got million ways the initial destination last destination is the same but the journey is different so suppose i have sa pa my first note is sa final note is pa i can go straight sa pa i can go sa ga pa i can go sa ga ma re pa sa ga ma re ni sa ga ma re pa sa ga ma sa ni da ba ma ba ga ma re sa ni sa ga re sa ni sa ga ma re pa so i'm starting and ending in the same note but my journey is varying you know and that journey is a melody so you know either it can be a good journey bad journey mediocre journey depending on how the traffic is how the road is how beautiful the nature is similarly this journey depicts how beautiful your melody is so that is how a creative process is simple that's beautiful um bit of a serious question how is uh, how is the <laughs> <laughs> thank you how how is the industry industry holding up how are your musicians and various other guys holding up during during these uh, crazy times see uh, you know for a for a person who's you know saved enough money in his life and who's done well for himself it's a it's a pretty okay time in the sense that uh, you know we get time to retrospect we get time to think we get time to create because normally we never spend enough time to you know sit back think you know ask questions and you know uh, create some music that way it's okay but for the daily musician for the person who is like for example playing in weddings or playing in in a temple or you know playing in a small band you know when you go to the hotel reception you see all these rajasthani musicians who welcome you in jaipur or when you go down south you know other swaram players are there those people are really really in a bad shape they are really really in a bad shape and also you know smaller musicians accompanying musicians so life is really really bad for them you know so that is that is the very very worrying part and so from our side you know we are continuously we are doing online concerts we are you know donating money we are trying to do it but you know how much ever do you, you know how it is our country uh, you know there are so many people in need so i really hope that something comes up and you know because it's going to be a long time before live concerts with you know 5000 people over there in the audience it actually starts you know, this, very true this is the yeah. new normal so i really yeah. hope something happens looking yeah. forward to that yeah <laughs> So Sanjeev, I'll extend that to your industry. What's what's happening there? Yeah. So uh, fortunately, as he uh, as Shankar said, that uh, people like us, uh, uh, we we uh, we may be okay, but uh, that that uh, I would say is a good thing because uh, then that gives us uh, power to look after uh, many uh, more people. Uh, but as a uh, industry, uh, so. Uh, I work across industries. I work in uh, hotel and restaurant industry, cookware industry, content. Uh, so some uh, parts are more affected uh, than the others, uh, and uh, largely the hotel and restaurant uh, industry has been uh, uh, hit uh, the hardest. Uh, and uh, in that, and that employs a lot. That employs a lot of people. Uh, it's the numbers are staggering. and uh, every every day it's uh, it's heartbreaking the, the stories that you hear uh, people have not been getting salaries people and uh, understand these these are not the uh, people they are not typical people that you can go and give your food they are not sitting on the road side they are not uh, you cannot find they are not uh, so called hungry they want to work it, it's not they don't want to beg they want they want to work and it's just that uh, there is no work uh, uh, for them and uh, th- those those numbers are uh, staggering uh, i i think uh, as, as a society uh, we can support uh, we can s- support uh, small uh, businesses uh, small people who are trying to do something uh, uh, 
I think all of us who are able, capable, rather than just giving the food and all, I think supporting business is going to be uh, as important and mm -hmm. small people, uh, look out for them. Uh, I, I think there will always be chance uh, to get a better pricing, maybe better quality from some somebody big, somebody a, a bigger name, bigger business. But I think next couple of years, it'll be very, very important to support uh, uh, smaller and, and that uh, small disc, uh, price uh, that you may pay more, maybe a little less quality that you may get, consider that as your contribution to the cause uh, of this. Uh, and that, that's what I would say. And, and in a more hopeful uh, note, the people are spending more time at home and perhaps more time in the kitchen. And, oh, yes. uh, and, and, and I'm sure a lot more people are looking up uh, Sanjeev Kapoor's uh, cookbooks right now to, to whip up those uh, <laughs> recipes. Uh, so, oh, yeah, so hopefully... YouTube. Yeah, now YouTube. Everyone is watching YouTube or uh, <laughs> food uh, channel or, or Facebook, Insta, wherever. Yes, that yeah. does happen. Actually, our, our uh, numbers uh, on um, people uh, watching our recipes uh, during this time has gone up uh, quite quite a lot. So home cooking, that's a good sign. Uh, home cooking has increased. Uh, I think the, for a healthier nation, uh, home cooking uh, is important. We need to uh, eat more home cooked uh, meals. I think so. That's a good sign. Yes. Yeah. Indeed. So, I'm uh, about to wrap the whole thing up. So, I'm going to come to you for. Um, some some advice for all of us uh, on on life's journey. I think uh, I think a lot of people have asked me lots of different questions on how do you balance <laughs> this versus the that. How do you do so many different things? There's lo so many questions. Uh, I'm just going to synthesize into your your final thoughts and your advice to everybody who's listening to you. <laughs> well, um, in life, what lesson I have learned is there are some portions of life, some part of life where, where you don't have a control on that. And that, those things, you should accept it. Whichever portion you have control, work your level best. Like, you know, you try your level best still. Health is something where, you know, in the old age, you can't help it. But whatever you can change, please work extremely hard. And try to live in a simple way, like how Sanjeev said, home cook food is the best. Similarly, simple way, living simple way is always the best because you don't have to pretend. And there is no stress in that. You don't have to show. And you don't have to prove anything to anybody. I, someone said, you can afford to talk, you are proved. I said, no. When I did not have anything also, when I had a financial problem, when I had a difficult time, still I never went and showed that I'm different than, you know, to give a different uh, personality to the world. What I am is what I am. Try to understand that. What you are, you are a gift from the God, a kind of a flower. Every flower is different. Don't compare. Comparison is the root cause of unhappiness. Don't compare. Compete with yourself every day. I'm a better person today. So what I request everyone is take your life as a gift from the God. Try to compete with yourself to be a better human being. There are some areas where you cannot fight, accept it as it comes. Some areas you can excel and try to excel. And always try to be happy as much as possible because we do not know what will happen. Like look at this pandemic, we never ever dreamt such things will come. I used to tell once upon a time there was a play, once upon a time we used to talk. Mm -hmm. In our lifetime we have seen this one. Mm -hmm. And whenever such situations are there, united we should fight. Not individual. United we should fight the pandemic. Life has shown any disease cannot kill entire mankind. Let it be plague, let it be cholera, let it be Spanish flu. It does not kill the world. We are stronger than the pandemic. Mm -hmm. And this is possible only when you all stick together, unite and say, see, World War One and Two uh, took almost two, three years and four years. This will not take that much time. It will take less time. Yes. So these difficult times, let us not crimp 
coordinate with everybody, cooperate with everybody, give your own contribution, however small, but start thinking that giving to someone and live happily as much as possible than cribbing and comparing with someone. Life has its own journey. What we plan actually it doesn't happen that way. But take it as it comes and be happy and be generous to everyone as much as possible. That's all I want to tell. Beautiful. Thank you. Thank you very much. And Shankar, on, on that hopeful and happy uh, note, I, I'm coming back to you to close it for us with a, with a beautiful song. Yeah, I'd like to sing something for our country, which, you know, I'm sure all of us on the screen, we are all very, very proud of. And all those people who are listening, wherever you all are, from different parts mm -hmm. of the of the world, you all are proud of this. So I'd like to close this whole thing with a song which is dedicated to our country which uh, I uh, composed for this film called Razi and written by the great Gulzar Sahib. So, Ay Vatan Mere Vatan Ay Vatan Abad Rahe Tu Abad Rahe Tu ए वतन वतन मेरे आबाद रहे तू ए वतन वतन मेरे आबाद रहे तू मैं जहां रहूं जहां में याद रहे तू ए वतन वतन मेरे आबाद रहे तू मैं जहां रहूं जहां में याद रहे तू ए वतन मेरे वतन ए वतन मेरे वतन तू ही मेरी मंजिल है पहचान तुझी से तू ही मेरी मंजिल है पहचान तुझी से पहुंचूं मैं जहां भी मेरी बुनियाद रहे तू पहुंचूं मैं जहां भी मेरी बुनियाद रहे तू ऐ वतन वतन मेरे आबाद रहे तू मैं जहां रहूं जहां में याद रहे तू ऐ वतन मेरे वतन ऐ वतन मेरे वतन वाओ देयर इज वेरी लिटिल आई कैन से आफ्टर दैट <laughs> uh, other than thanking all of you for you know being up so early and just being such a wonderful uh, set of guests, and uh, I think uh, Akshay Patra is blessed uh, to to have all of you. And uh, with that, I'll hand it over to Vandana. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you all. আর মোর ঘর চারিজনী পরিয়াল মোর দুজনী ছি ডরজনী মধুস্মিতা দাস আর সরুজনী নিশিতা দাস নিজের কারণে বো নিজের অল্প হয় আর বেলে বেলেগর কারণে নব নিজের কারণে বো মানে এনে ঘর এনে থাকার ধরে তাই পড়ি কিনে খুব ভাল পায় মানে স্কুল ক্ষতি নকরে কোনো দিনে স্কুল সদায় যায় ভালকে মই সুধু आज की हिकाला की कर बारे से की पढ़ाई से होते ही नहीं किने कोई मैं स्कूल ताई पर पर बाव पढ़ी किने बहुत भल बाव मैं ताऊ ताऊ ने मास्टर ने बाव जो पढ़ी किने तो बाइडो हाँ बोले कौन से मास्टर ने बोले कौन से ताऊ लेकिन आज ने वालों की कर बाबा रू पर लेकिन तो जब ने करी मैं रहती पर थी तात मजू सा� अलमान हेलू हेली है ना और कासा तो है स्कूल ताऊ स्कूल तो पढ़ो अलमान पढ़े है ना लेज़र दे भात खाओ भात खाए ना अलमान हेलू हेली है ना घर जा घर जा ना अलमान हेलू हेली के ना बागे डाउ बागे ठीक है ना हरी बहुत ठीक है ना आरु पढ़ो राती हत्तर पेरे सारे हत्तर के पढ़ो ना उतर पैगेट 
ঘরত অল্প আছে তো কিন্তু তাতে ইচ্ছা বেশি কিন্তু তথাপি যেখানে ঘরত পড়ে সেখানে কিন্তু ভালে পড়ে আর ময়ো অল্প যত্ন নিজে লো কারণ কি ময়ো বর্তমান ঘরতে থাকো তার শিক্ষার যাণ যে ওজন আছে ওজন বা পরিমাণ হয় না বহুত বেশি মানে ভাববা নি তাহলে এই তো ভবিষ্যৎ নিজের দেহাটোর যে ভবিষ্যৎ আছে বলে কয় সে কারণে আর আনোর কারণেও আছে এই So thank you everyone. I do hope you enjoyed the conversation of these amazing personalities and of course the beautiful music from Shankar Mahadevan. I urge you to look up the story of Madhusmita and millions of children like her who depend on that one meal of the day that they get when they come to school. The one meal ensures that they come to school, have a good meal, they are able to focus in class and complete a good education. Your support is very necessary. Please learn more about us at foodforeducation.org. 